Welcome back to GHP3 Devlog. I'm James Thrush, lead developer. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about the gear in GHP3. Now obviously the gear is such a critical component of all the Greg Hastings paintball games. Now Greg has done a great job already of getting all the major manufacturers signed up. we got a huge list and it's growing daily. Now my job is once he signs those companies to get their gear into the game, make it authentic, realistic, and fun. So that's what I want to talk to you guys about and get your feedback because we have a lot of exciting things planned for gear customization, both visuals, being able to anodize, doing laser etching, doing hydro dipping, changing colors. It's one of our most requested features from previous GHP games that we want to expand on in this one. And in addition to just visual stuff, we want to actually let you customize the functionality of your marker. So trigger modes, uh, different barrels, different firing modes, uh, electronics, obviously changing tanks, hoppers, the electronics inside those. So whether you're into speedball markers, mil sim markers, clip, tactical stuff, we're gonna have it all in GHP3. Uh, one thing we're really excited about is adding for the mil sim guys, Picatinny rails. So you'll have a wide variety of optional equipment, laser sights, R7 replay cameras, red dot sights, flashlights stuff that you can accessorize, customize your marker, in addition to the look and feel of it. If you guys have some favorite customizations that you like to do on your own markers, please let us know. We'll see if we can make them in the game. 